Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. So today, obviously, we are in a car. I wanted to do a come shop with me type of video. Um, I'm getting ready for my trip to California. And so I saw that I was running low on a few skincare items that I know are my staple. They're my holy grail. I love them, need them, and they're just a must in my skincare routine. So I thought, you know what? Not only am I going to show you guys skincare products that you guys are sleeping on, at the drugstore that you may not even be aware and b i also want to make sure that i put you guys on some affordable skincare products i believe that some high-end products are totally worth splurging on but there's also some drugstore products that have worked amazing for my skin so i hope you guys enjoy this video we are here at walmart so let's go shopping <laughs> Okay guys, so we're going to start off with some cleansers. So I'm just going to show you guys the ones that I have personally tried and I have used. I'm not going to go into too much detail because I actually have a video coming up. And I'm going to show you guys all of my favorite drugstore oil cleansers. But these two are the ones that are available. This one is the Burt's Bees Cleansing Oil. Hello, can we focus? There we go. So this one has coconut and argan oils. And this one is by Neutrogena. This is the Ultra Lights Cleansing Oil. I love these. I have repurchased the Neutrogena about three or four times. And this is the one that I'm currently using right now. If you guys don't remove your makeup with the cleansing oil, sis, what are you doing? These are going to make your life so much easier. Literally, all you need is about a pump, maybe two. And then you just get some makeup remover wipes like the Pons or the Equate, whatever you want. These melts your makeup right off. They make your skin look super smooth, super bomb. And then, of course, you want to go in and cleanse your face, which is why it's called a double cleanse because you cleanse your skin with this and then you go in with your face wash and just remove all the excess dirt, makeup, debris, oil, all that stuff. So definitely a must. If you guys are not using a cleansing oil, use it and uh, thank me later. <laughs> For your cleanser, there is actually two, three that I, I personally recommend. One is this one by CeraVe. CeraVe is an amazing brand at the drugstore. It has really good ingredients. This one is for dry skin. So for all my dry skin girls out there, this one is so good. It cleanses, hydrates, and helps restore the productive skin barriers. All of the CeraVe products come with three essential ceramides, which are going to help your skin just stay pretty much looking bomb. It also comes with hyaluronic acid, which if you don't know, hyaluronic acid is amazing for just keeping your skin moisturized. This one is super bomb. My sister uses this one and she swears by it. It's just really good for dry skin in general. I personally haven't tried it because a girl is a little bit more oily, but with this, I mean, you get so much product for $10.99. $10.98. Now, this is one that I have personally tried, and this is actually by Cetaphil, not CeraVe. Two different brands. This one is their Pro Derma Control Oil Removing Foam Wash. If you guys are a fan of the Kylie Jenner face wash, you guys are going to love this. This is specifically for oily skin girls. I love this. The only thing that I do have to say is that this can dry out your skin, so just use it maybe once or twice maybe three times a week i would just test it out and see how it works every skin is different so what might work for you might not work for me but this one is really good for unclogging your pores and just removing all the oil and all the dirt and i love that it's a foam and it's a pump and it just uh, it makes it so much fun to just remove all your makeup another face wash that is also one of my favorites is the neutrogena hydro boost hydrating cleansing gel Oh my god, this is the one that I'm kind of in between right now. I'm using this one and the Kylie one. Um, but this one, I always reach for it when my skin is hella dry or hella thirsty. This one is so yummy, you guys. It makes your skin feel so soft. I like that it removes the makeup, but it doesn't strip the skin. And it's so soft. So if you have sensitive skin, I highly recommend this one. Like, There's so many face washes that you can use. You just kind of have to look at the ingredients and make sure that you know you're getting things appropriate for your skin type 
So I definitely love this one and I mean dermatologist recommended. Uh, yes, please. Also, I forgot to mention I always go in with micellar water because not all the time will your cleanser remove everything and you don't want to apply your skincare products on top of dirt, oil, or um, residue of makeup. So make sure that you always go in with micellar water. This one is my favorite by Garnier. I've tried this one, the waterproof. I don't like this one. I hated it. This one left my skin super greasy because it is for waterproof makeup. So definitely didn't like this one but my favorite one is this one right here this is like the original one I love this I swear by it I've gone through bottles and bottles of this I actually need a backup so they have this new one this is for mattifying which is kind of cool and then they have this one rose water and glycerin all-in-one hydrating so this one's for hydrating and this is for mattifying i'm gonna take a small one though because i'm gonna take one to our california trip i also have this one by the brand simple i actually have never tried this one and this one is the same price six dollars and 96 cents so if you guys have tried this one let me know because i might try it out just for the fun of it um, but yeah, haven't given this one a shot yet. I've just stuck with Garnier. Also, quick note, if you guys suffer from texture skin, if you guys suffer from acne, this one is amazing. I actually gave this one to my little cousin and her skin cleared up in like three days. This will get rid of any texture on your skin, any acne because it does contain salicylic acid, which is perfect for drying out those stubborn acne marks you guys this stuff is really 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 good perfect for texture skin now when it comes to exfoliators you guys i actually don't have any of the drugstore that i personally like i personally like a chemical exfoliator because those will penetrate deeper into the dermis of the skin and actually remove all the gunk that's inside your pores any old skin things like that so i'm going to insert a picture of a chemical peel that i personally really really love and it's really a Affordable. You can find it at Ulta. It's by the brand The Ordinary. I swear by it. It literally changed my skin. So let's move on to some moisturizers with SPF. Another amazing product. If you guys are oily skin and suffer from either blackheads or whiteheads, the Biore Charcoal Deep Cleansing Pore Strips. These are the best. I've tried so many, you guys, and I'm not lying. I have tried so many from different brands. And these are the ones that I just always come back to. These are a little bit pricey. You get, um, let's see, you get about six strips for five dollars so they are a bit pricey but honestly like they just work if you guys can get these to work the best way that i can recommend is right after you shower i usually take like pretty steamy hot showers so your skin is like a little bit soft i say that your pores are open a lot of people like to dispute that i don't know i am not a professional dermatologist but it works for me so right after i get out of the shower again hot steamy shower you pop these on you make sure that your nose is wet and you will see so much gunk come out of these it is so satisfying i'm actually going to grab me some because mama needs some <laughs> okay you guys so i am actually not finding any of the moisturizers that contain spf that i personally use so i will insert a picture right here so you guys can see what i'm talking about um i guess my walmart kind of sucks because they don't have anything so let's keep hunting and let's see what else we find Okay, you guys, so I am back in my car. I actually had to cut the video short. The lady that worked at Walmart, uh, she was kind of getting annoyed because I was filming. She was like, um, you're actually not supposed to be filming in here. I was like, girl, try me. <laughs> I'm just kidding. So I'm just going to show you guys. I only got two things, and I'm pretty sure you guys saw what I got. I ended up getting a backup of the Biore Charcoal Deep Cleansing Pore Strips. These definitely come in clutch when you know it's all cochina and gunked up. And I also got a little mini size travel of the Garnier Skin Active Micellar Cleansing Water. Um, because I am currently using another one from a different brand and I don't like it. But I hate wasting stuff so I'm just trying to like use it up. Um, but this baby's an hour. <laughs> this baby's going to come with me to my California trip. So those are all the products that I was able to show you guys. If I didn't show you any moisturizers. Again, first of all, I didn't 
find the ones that I personally have used. I obviously recommend for you to use a moisturizer that is not only going to be a good humectant for your skin, but that is also going to contain SPF so it can keep your skin from aging. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this mini trip to Walmart and I hope you guys try out some of this new drugstore skincare stuff if you haven't and let me know what your favorite is and maybe even your skin type if you're oily or dry so you can help another girlfriend out. Thank you guys so much for joining me today and I will see you guys in my next video because I have a bunch of recess that I'm going to eat to myself before I get home. <laughs> so I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.